The project itself started, I think, in 2014, in the early part of 2014. It opened in April 2015. Robert McKelvey was the construction engineer uh, who, who basically constructed this pitch. Prior to this, there was just bog here, and uh, we have now got a, a, a brilliant AstroTurf uh, pitch, all-weather pitch, and we've got the fencing around it. And it was quite a challenging uh, operation for, for any contractor to take on because uh, it was bog and uh, it was very deep bog. It wasn't bog that could be dug away, so there had to be a foundation laid down on it and it had to be left for a, a long time to settle. So a lot of the material that went into the foundation that was sourced locally here on the island and there was a local contractor who was involved in in that aspect of the, the pitch. There was no issues with transport. We have a very, very good and reliable ferry service and there was there was nothing came to light for us anyway in relation to there being a problem with getting any materials that we needed transported here to, to the island. The construction part of it itself involved not just the laying of it, the footpaths, and we have uh, bays in it for the lights as well. They're all included in it and we're going to be getting our lights done now in the coming year. As you can see the job is done and it's been an operation now for uh, I would say about over six months and we're very very happy with it so far and the island community are very happy with it and everyone seems seems to be happy with the, the, the standard and the quality of the pitch and it's been used quite a lot not just by ourselves here in the school, but by the in, uh, a number of uh, interest groups here on the island.